guys, what's up? How's it going? Today we're going to go over how to draw a T-Rex versus Carnotaurus from Jurassic Park. Uh, it's going to be two headshots, kind of like verses, so hopefully you enjoy it and follow along if you can, okay? So let's get started. I'm going to go over here and draw the T-Rex first on this side and the Carnotaurus on this side. So, let me see. So right here I'm going to start with kind of the brow, that top brow of the T-Rex. Uh, every animal has this brow hang, hanging over the eye. And that's to protect from rain, from dust, from stuff getting in there. Line over here for kind of the top of the snout area. Down right here for the front of the mouth. Pulling up. Right here, kind of like a curved shape. And another curved shape right here for kind of the cheekbone area. Line back, which I think they call the jugo bone, I'm not sure. Uh, gonna go right here from this point, and I'm gonna pull a line over here for the back of the head. Like so. Now I'm gonna go into the eye right here, okay? So line over here. Curve line underneath. If you love dinosaurs, by the way, I have an entire playlist on them. I'll put the link in the description. I'm gonna go over here for the nostril. Curve here on this side for you know, kind of just the just the area underneath that line over here. It's kind of a curve in uh, that area, kind of like a bump on top of the snout there. And we're gonna throw bags underneath the eyes right there and uh, line right here. Let's pull a line down here and make them look a little angry, right? You gotta make them look a little angry. Curve right here for the back right there where lizards have like their hearing and stuff like that. Line open here because the mouth is gonna be open. And there's a skin layer inside the mouth. You see it on crocodiles now. Line out over here for the lower jaw. Curve in the back here. Back here for the back of the jaw there. Forward and pull up. Cool, cool. Now we're going to throw the teeth in here to kind of make them look you know, menacing, and the teeth are all curved back in because it's like pulling stuff in. You get that a lot from like different animals. Uh, you see that a lot in nature. That's just kind of the way they evolved. It's like you're pulling in stuff. I know T-Rex's teeth were like a bunch of bananas, right? About the size of bananas. They're like these huge things. I'm gonna go over here for the bottom row now. Like so. Gonna go right here, find the tongue and right there. And maybe throw a little darkness in the back there and fill that in. Right on. Over here, this is a big mistake a lot of people make when drawing the T-Rex. You wanna make sure there's a throat here, right? Make sure there's a throat. Don't just straight line down. Line here, line here. And you can draw curved lines right there for some texture and you can do the same thing over here uh, like draw these little curved U shapes so you can put them everywhere for just kind of make it look like scales right curve here curve here Like so. Cool, cool. So that's the T Rex side. Um, now let's go over here and draw the Carnotaurus. Carnotaurus is a more of a flat head kind of thing, so we're gonna go over that. We're gonna go right here. Line over here for the front of his face. Back. You got that really cool horn. Carnotaurus is like actually my favorite dinosaur. I love that dinosaur. Um, back over here and down. It's got a very like smaller head 
like this this wise, right? The T-Rex head's pretty long. This one's a shorter head. Line over here. And it's a little flatter, so the cheekbone isn't as prominent. By the way, hit the like. Uh, if you love dinosaurs, hit that like button, okay? Let me know what you think in the comments section about kind of dinosaurs. Well, what's your favorite dinosaur? That would really be awesome. Like I said, I just said mine is the Carnotaurus. I'm going to go right here, curve up, line. Line underneath. Line, line, line. For bags in the VIs. And we're going to put some line right there. Nasal cavity right there in the front. Line on the inside right here for the open mouth. Curve out. Line down. One thing about him is his lower jaw is pretty small in comparatively, like right there. And we're going to go over here, find the throat, and out over there. Looks like a turtle right now, but we're going to give him some teeth. All right, same thing with the teeth. here tongue this one I want to stick in the tongue out a little bit and we're gonna draw a line on the other side for that skin texture and the skin on the other side to make it look deeper too you want to draw that dark area back over here for kind of that ear area far side horn curve line 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 along the horns right there for kind of that texture and maybe a line over here for kind of the changing of the, of the form right here line 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 and same thing right here we're gonna draw a bunch of curves for kind of just like that textured area yeah, like right here as well for the uh, you know the scales um, let me know if you want to see more drawings of dinosaurs, please let me know that. Uh, it will be amazing and share the video if you do because I love, love, love dinosaurs. Anyways, that's it. I want to thank you very much and I will talk to you in the next video, okay? Talk to you soon and I'll see you next time. Ooh, also, don't forget, hit the subscribe and go check out the official website on sketchingeasy.com. See ya.